Hello, welcome to the show. Today we're pairing food with beer. If any of you hose heads don't like beer or food, you can take off, eh? Okay, today we're gonna pair a dogfish head worldwide stout with food, or attempt to anyway. Now, real quick rundown on this beer. It's very highly rated, both by uh, Beer Advocate, gives it an A- rating, and Rate Beer gives it a 100. Um, it's an American Double Imperial Stout, very, very high alcohol, at 18% by volume. Okay, I'm gonna pour some of Dogfish Head's Worldwide Stout into a snifter, and we're gonna try to get some of the flavor profile on what to what what it'll pair what foods it'll pair good with now uh, after doing the research on beer advocate and rate beer um, kind of some of the items we're looking for is we're looking for kind of a burnt dark fruit molasses bitter chocolate coffee toasted malt smoke prune cola figs raisin tobacco notes so those are kind of some of the ideas and I'll just kind of get an idea for myself on what would go good with this beer. Okay, now that we have our flavor profile down, definitely picking up on the dark fruit molasses, but a little bit of, on the back note of the dark chocolate, dark, dark coffee. So for the start of our appetizer, which is gonna, we're gonna do kind of a dessert bonbon style thing, we're gonna use some sun-dried plums, or if you want to be crass, prunes. We're going to chop those up. We're going to mix with a little bit of blackberry preserves. And we're going to take some chocolate graham crackers. We're going to crush those up. Form it into a ball around our center filling of the prunes and blackberry. A little drizzle of some caramel sauce. And then last but not least, little toasted almonds on the outside and we're going to use a little melted butter with the crushed graham crackers to kind of help hold it together and the fat from the butter and the almonds will certainly be welcome with this ultra high alcohol beer okay i have here some of our chopped plums i'm going to mix it with some of our blackberry just a little bit just enough to uh, incorporate some of the flavors okay now we're going to add our spoonful of our sun-dried plum and blackberry preserve mixture and we're gonna roll it around and form it into a ball. Okay, now see I have a nicely formed ball with uh, sun-dried plums and blackberry in the center and it's been rolled in the chocolate graham crackers. There you have it. We have a little morsel here drizzled with caramel sauce, rolled in toasted almonds. An amazing morsel to go with your dogfish head to build life stuff. All right, so I want to give a couple shout outs. Beer Advocate, Jizak FH, and Barley Wine Fiend for their excellent reviews on Dogfish Head Worldwide Stout. And Rate Beer Reviewers, The Hopster, and Duffman. Thanks for your excellent reviews and information. And of course, big shout out to Odie's Big Ten Markets for their excellent beer selection where I purchased today's Dogfish Head Worldwide Stout. The shit I do on my day off. <laughs>